the number one issue around fighting climate change is food waste. 40% of food is wasted globally. And some of it's ending up in piggeries, livestock, landfill, places that it's not helping from a human health standpoint or the environment. Hello, sir. How are you? So this is Faves, my climate candy, and it's made of imperfectly perfect fruits and vegetables. It tastes like strawberry and cherry starburst. Faves are fruit chew candy made out of upcycled fruits and vegetables. So you get your servings of fruits and vegetables through something as easy and accessible and affordable like candy, and you don't realize that you're doing something good for the planet. My family is Spangler Candy Company, and we make two billion Dum Dum Lollipops every year, along with many other nostalgic candies. I used to make my own hybrid Dum Dum flavors. So we would put one in each cheek. So I used to like putting lemon in one and lime in the other. Within all the issues of the day, climate change, that became something that I really cared about. Candy is a $10 billion industry yearly in just the U.S. So you can make a big change. I knew this, you can't start a candy factory out of a garage because you can't do anything small in the candy world. If we're gonna make a real change in the world and we're gonna get the bigger contracts, it's gotta be something where I can make millions at a time and hundreds of thousands of packs. Across the board, farms are all the same. They're all having high wastage. It's literally just the dimensions of the fruits and vegetables that don't work with grocery stores. We wanted to work with farmers in specific areas so our transportation footprint would be lighter because we didn't want to be trekking things across the country. It's called climate candy. It needed to get to a point of becoming something that had higher shelf life. All right, well, I think we're ready to go. We'll see, blueberry, raspberry, cherry. What are we doing today? Cherry, what is it? Cherry strawberry today. Cherry strawberry, it yep. is. The classics, perfect. Yep. Machinery's right underneath, okay. and we have enough of a workspace here that we can do anything that needs to be done, you know, combining flavors or just metering it, you know, whatever's Amazing. gotta be done. That's when we came in and said, why can't it be an ingredient and make it into puree or powders? Yeah, I love this, but you can see the powder going in. Oh, it's amazing. After it becomes a powder, a puree, a juice, we make it into faves. Here, try one. Okay, so it really, it tastes like peach and mango, mm -hmm. but it's carrots and beets and squash and sweet potato and pumpkin. Mm -hmm. So you're eating your vegetables right now. We consider our faves a candy because it has that sweetness that offsets your sweet tooth, and we advertise it in that way. We're trying to say, look, you have to eat your five to eight servings of fruits and vegetables daily, and for them to recognize that there's a way for them to do it in a, in a fun way. Just try one. You know? Just try it, try it. See what you think. We've learned over the years that people love the fact that they're rescuing fruits and vegetables. Oh, really good. I know. If something that you build it has synergies with your mission, your vision, your values as a person, it makes it very easy to wake up in the morning and say, I'm making that change, and I know that the world will be better off if I succeed.